uh, Laura Paris is with us right now from the Shulman Law Firm. Laura, thank you very much for your time. Hi, thanks for having me. I, I, so do you help people write a lot of these things? Prenups? Yeah. Uh, they're starting to become uh, more of a trend, I'd say, in, in, in recent years. Um, and the reason that I've noticed is that a lot of, um, you know, the, the younger generation is coming into marriage with money that they've actually gotten from their parents. So whether it be by way of like an actual lump sum of, of cash or, you know, perhaps a property that, um, that a parent has purchased or put a down payment on for them that they're ultimately looking to protect in the event that um, they end up being separated and their you know their marriage doesn't doesn't work out so if you were a talk radio consultant with the knowledge that you had and i came to you and i said laura i'm thinking about doing a topic on prenups do you think there's a lot of phone calls there what would you say laura is that like a really dangerous thing that i've just decided to do that is unheard of in radio before are you saying you should have no problem getting a lot of phone calls you know i i think that they are more common than we like to think, but I think people don't really like talking about them because there's this negative connotation that's been, um, you know, been applied to them that makes it seem like, well, if you got a prenup, it means yeah. that, you know, you're expecting the marriage to end. So or you're a gold I, digger or, exactly. you know, I don't ask you how much money you make a year because that's rude and maybe asking if somebody's got a prenup is up there with um, how much money you do make. So right. um, in Canada, is it different than down in the United States in terms of our laws? Uh, so, uh, I mean, the, in, in the way that uh, matrimonial property is divided, there's definitely, I mean, there's differences even amongst, um, even amongst different provinces. So to speak, you know, to, uh, to the U.S. is difficult for me to say. I'm not really familiar with, um, with the way matrimonial pop- property is divided in the U.S. Uh, here, uh, what we what we do have is gen- generally speaking, it's fifty fifty division of assets on the on uh, upon the breakdown of the marriage. Um, and the reason that you you know would choose to enter into a prenup is basically to protect anything that you had prior to the marriage um, and any increases in value um, relating to that property that you or assets that you own prior to the marriage. So if I end a home right now and it's valued at five hundred thousand dollars, can I protect that five hundred thousand dollars, or is that going to when we split it, uh, will it just be split on what has gone over for five hundred thousand dollars? So actually, the uh, the the Family Law Act in Ontario actually has a mechanism that does protect uh, assets that are owned on the date of marriage, except for the matrimonial home. Matrimonial home has special treatment. So let's say you owned an investment property worth five uh, five hundred thousand dollars, as you said, you would be entitled to a deduction at the end of the marriage for the value of of what the property was worth on the date of marriage it's the increase in value that you have to that that you have to be concerned about um because that will be unless you specifically stipulate in a in a something like a prenuptial agreement uh that is something that would be subject to division uh in the event of a a separation all right um laura thank you very much for your time i really appreciate it of course from the shulman law firm family lawyer laura paris with us your phone calls in a couple of seconds time again uh, I've been told not to do this because oh, you're going to have such a hard time finding people who've got a prenup. Oh, yeah? 416-872-1010. 416-872-1010. Let's see if this is a fail for Jim Richards in the news in about 15 minutes' time. Can you help the police track down a man who's responsible for, uh, who, who they're looking for, for a first-degree murder charge? That at 1.30, right now, 15 minutes after 1 o'clock. 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 